Hello everyone, welcome back. We are currently in Michigan at Michigan State University and we're gonna be upgrading the telescope control system for their 1969 Bowler and Chivins 24 inch telescope. Close to the end of the day, but we've got a lot of work done. A lot of work on the dome and the new telescope control system. Now working on the focuser. It's gonna get dark in the next hour or two, so we'll see you then. All right, a very productive day. My colleague has finished redoing all the telescope control system when he had, he had the cables going down and to the control room so that it can be operated completely via the computer. No more manual controls, which is gonna be fantastic. I just finished running all of the cabling for the camera and the guide camera so that that's all nice and clean all the way through the mount and back down to the control center as well. And so now we're just going to be waiting for dark and we'll be able to do some on-sky observing and some training for the actual personnel here at MSU. Oh, that last one was ten and a half minutes. Yes, I know. <laughs> He's gonna be very upset when he sees that. You would know one person just like runs all the way. No, uh, we definitely have a those people. gear fell out off the motor. It is no longer positioned properly. The software thought it was still moving, but obviously it wasn't. And so it really, really doesn't know where it is right now. Are we like almost planted at Vega? Not anymore. Um, I mean, it's, it's right there, you can see it, 
but we are definitely off from Vega. Should we should we point it at Vega and just align it using that star? Sure, we can do that. Okay. So uh, note the position, the RA deck of Vega. All right, it is now nighttime on pretty much our last day. We got everything set up and we've been training the students here. So now we're gonna go down into the control room and start taking some observations. project is complete. This telescope now has a completely new telescope control system. It's already been going strong for 55 years and it has another 55 years to go with the new system. Thank you so much for coming and thank you to MSU for letting us work on such a historic telescope. Until next time.